Many of those sales and promotions at stores are designed to make you think you are getting a great deal, but are you? Consumer reporter John Matteries has something to watch out for so you don't waste your money. All of us love a deal when we're shopping, but it turns out many of the things we purchase in stores are not quite the deals they appear to be. Instead, it's slick retail marketing, or as some call it, sneaky store tricks. None of us is immune to the occasional impulse purchase while we're shopping, but stores are doing more and more to encourage it. MoneyWatch.com calls it pricing psychology and lists some tricks that retailers use to get you to buy more. Among them, the five per customer limit, which makes you think the item is red hot and scarce. Another trick, according to MoneyWatch, big promotions with prices ending in 99, like this Tide detergent for 17.99. It's really 18 bucks. And if they put that promotion on an end cap or at the store entrance, it can be doubly hard to resist. And from the Doesn't That Stink file, two more tricks that are very effective at getting you to spend more than you planned. The first, 10 for $10. We all know you don't have to buy 10, but many shoppers still do. Nine more than you really need? You'll say, Doesn't That Stink? And finally, BOGO, or buy one, get one free. Money Watch says shoppers can't resist BOGO and often buy two pairs of shoes when they never even planned on buying one pair. Retailers and restaurants throughout the tri-state all want you to think you landed a good deal when you made a purchase. So it's a good idea to be prepared for the come-ons, the twofers, and the great displays that await you when you walk into stores these days. That way you don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris, not on your side.